I'm not sure if they're gonna notice this. Of course, the pickup of oh, pick that up was a tusk. Naga yeah, tusk picked up the down. medallion here. Even has a gem. Oh, they're gonna get spotted. Troll's gonna use his ult. Of course, the armor for Roshan is very low thanks to that medallion of courage. Uh, will they song time this? Oh my, oh my god. god, the initiation from Kuroki stuns everybody's song to follow. They're just gonna kill Rosh, take the Aegis, and they could probably take this fight. Tinker doing a lot of damage. Take oh, Omni Knight actually uses his ult as well. Again, stun from Kuroki on three or four at least. The Tuts is gonna use his snowball to keep himself alive at least for now. Soul Assumption. Kills off the pug that troll dead, dragon knight dead. This is a disaster for PR. Even puppies up oh, finally goes down. That's the first death though in this fight for, for secret. Oh the purification at the last the universe second. roared on the backside. They're trying to position himself in front of him so he can take more damage. Bristle back. Can he live through this? He's gonna run away, he's getting healed. And in the meantime, S4 invisible running away. He is tracked. Kuroki, one more right click to die back for Warlock. Fear in the meantime was going to get killed. Is this enough for Secret to actually finish this game? This is unbelievable. The toss was at a creep. I don't even know what that was, but PBD is going to get bursted down. Everybody's dead except for Lich. Uh, they will give up on it and defend bottom themselves. And actually, this should be denied. It is by Puppy BKB by S4. Life Sealer still inside of her. Must feel really good being inside that delicious watch. We have Ice Bad News. Big Daddy getting quite low. It's gonna end up being a trade secret. Only lose one, one to four, and it's gonna be an end up being a team wipe. Alliance are obviously off to a way better start than the previous game. They're still behind, but not by much. Last game at this point, they were behind by like 5,000 gold experience almost. Oh, or mid lane epicenter, blink combination into Burrow Strike. Tinker finally is taken out. Oh, that Nether Strike range is redonkulous. In fact, it puts Hani in terrible position. Searing chain on to uh oh AA ult is gonna destroy Loda. Will in all likelihood go down to this AA ult, and there is another dual one for Kuroki. He lost on the night. He willingly went four and five. And the turnaround potential was way too much to deal with. They were able to focus the egg, especially how they isolated Puppy here was really nice. They identified the opportunity to go for it. Dendi hexes him out. Cross plays into him and Dendi bursts him down. I think they weren't aware of the hex. Oh, Kuroki with a mana void oh, dealing with Quark comes out of nowhere. Of course, he still has the Aegis. Man score on the run gets miscoiled. Kuroki doesn't give two shits if he's gonna die here. He gets one kill in the meantime. Make it two, and he's gonna heal Goblock up. But that's fine, because they're just gonna make this three kills just like that. Huge ultra kill for Kuroki. And he still has Aegis.